Three days until the big game, and we are looking at NFL stars from right here in the Magnolia State. Sports Zone 12's Blake Levine tells us about one player continuing a tradition of great athletes from the city of Starkville. Blake? There's no denying the numbers Tennessee Titans wide receiver A.J. Brown put up on the field this season, but what he means to his hometown of Starkville, I'm not sure you can quantify that. Starkville, Mississippi, a city that breeds football stars. Oh! By AJ Brown! Add AJ Brown to that list, Tennessee Titans wide receiver. Um, I've always known that he would play in the NFL. Cynthia Millens, AJ's 10th grade English teacher at Starkville High School, knew the overly competitive kid in her class would be a star. But that wasn't the first thing she noticed about him. That smile. It's hard to see if he's taking anything serious because of that bright smile of his. And while that smile followed Brown to the field, his high school coaches didn't have to guess if he was taking football serious or not. But convincing him he was an elite athlete, a different story. You know, he wore number 15 before I got there, and I asked him one time at uh, uh, didn't he want to wear number one? And he said he had to think about it because number one meant she was the best player on the team. And I said, AJ, I think everybody knows she's the best player on the team. And yes, he was the leading player on Starkville's 2015 state championship team, something you can't erase and stays in the halls of the high school forever. It's very exciting to see someone who was in your classroom. He, I mean, literally in my classroom, and now he's representing Starkville. He's representing Mississippi very well. Just notoriety. I mean, it just um, being here and, and people knowing that he, he's from Starkville. Willie Gillespie knows the pressures of playing in the NFL and coming from Starkville. AJ's wide receiver coach during his time at the school. He's playing a man game, uh, but he's such a kid at heart. I always come back here to Starkville, man, and spend time with the kids, uh, talk with them about what's important, uh, talk about how he got what he's doing. Over 1,000 yards and 11 touchdowns in 2020. That's what AJ is doing in front of the camera. But behind the scenes, doing the little things for people who helped him along the way, priceless. They beat Houston, and I saw him catch that, you know, that huge catch, and I was like, oh, AJ, but it's just, it's, it's, a, it's very exciting. You know, my grandchildren got their picture made with him. They, they, they love it, you know, and they, they look at AJ, my little grandson is five, and every receiver on TV is AJ Brown. AJ Brown, he catches a ball for a living, hoping to find himself in the end zone where he can smile at the camera, something he's been doing his whole life in Starkville. Now, tomorrow night, we profile Mississippi's own Sarah Thomas and how she'll make history on the field this coming Sunday. Blake Levine, Sports Zone 12.